Betty has been rampaging around our home, but we've managed to trap him by shutting all the doors. If you talk to the other brothers, they will open the gates and guide you to him. By concentrating, I should be able to open this door for you. when you know how to chant like this. Enemies like those yaks are too big to be charged. Your flame attack should easily take care of large enemies. When you defeat an enemy, it will release a spirit particle. The spirit particles will activate the power-up in that world. If a power-up is inactive, you need to defeat more enemies. Remember Hunter's advice. You will glide farthest if you press the X button at the very top of your jump. Even though I'm a vegetarian, I think you should kill that yeti. He's pretty tough though. In fact, I'm not so sure you're up to it. I thought the yeti was tougher than that. I guess he was all bark. <laughs> anyway, I was just guarding our sacred talisman to make sure the Yeti didn't eat it.
Oh, thank goodness you scared that evil spirit away. But now it will hide in the statues. If you were to flame all ten statues, I'm sure you would chase it away for good. <laughs> Well done, Spyro! You've scared the evil spirit away! Why don't you take this? I borrowed it from the temple. Eh, they don't need it. Welcome! We have found that hockey is a peaceful and calming sport. Would you like to join in a match against our goalkeeper? You have two minutes to score five goals in the red goal. <laughs> Oh. 
Oh. Try a game of one on one. The first to score five goals wins. You are shooting at the red goal. Off you go.
Hello there, Spyro. Would you like to learn to swim underwater? I suppose I could teach you for uh, a small fee? Great. Okay, when you jump in the water, you can use the D-pad to move around the surface. Use square to dive underwater. When you are underwater, use X to paddle and square to charge. <laughs> Spyro, the idols we were carving have come to life! They've locked us out of our temples and stolen our food! Our tools and the giant idol won't let the workers in unless we can solve the three puzzles they've given us. The first puzzle is to turn all these blocks yellow. If you have trouble, come back and talk to me. Wow, Spyro, you did it! I mean, I knew you could do it. Now, meet me at the pond for the next challenge. <laughs> this idol says he's hungry and won't be satisfied until he's swallowed ten fish. He's got a sensitive stomach, so watch what kind of fish you feed him.
Okay, Spyro, just one more puzzle to go. I'll meet you over by the College Stones for your final challenge. Those metal shields are making enemies invulnerable to your flame attack. If you press and hold the square button, you can defeat them with your charge attack. left or right, press the L2 or R2 button. If you jump on these stones in the correct order, you will solve the puzzle! I only know what the first one is. It's up to you to figure the rest out. Nice job, Spyro. You're pretty smart for a dragon. All I have to give you is this shiny thing I found in our toolbox. You're pretty tough. If you ever want a permanent job, we've got a place for you here. For the moment, I want you to have this talisman. Fabulous to see you, Spyro. 
Now that the supercharged power-up is active, you can charge through the pedestals and send the dancing hula girls over here to help me. <laughs> Look at that. The hula girl's rain dance blew up that idol like a Roman candle. Now I can pursue that dancing career I've dreamed of. Take this orb. It could help you go places. Mm.